I met Margaret Atwood, and we foraged for wild mushrooms. Wow, sounds like you were in a real rush to get here. The point is, I've got a lot of life left in me. And so do you. Easy for you to say. You don't have a terminal illness. Oh, for God's sake, you don't have... Brian, what are you doing? Don't touch that. That's the infected Play-Doh. Brian, no, stop! There. Now I have cooties too. And I don't care. You... you don't? We all have cooties. Whether it's illness or loneliness or turning 70, nothing is promised. We could get run over by a car or struck by lightning. We could be hit with an unprecedented pandemic that the government is slow to recognize, woefully unprepared for, and then mismanages with reckless incompetence. But that's all the more reason to appreciate the time we do have. I mean, look around. Look at this room. It's beautiful. Right. did you eat those mushrooms you found? Yeah, you actually look like a very old witch right now, but I'm also just happy to be alive. And you should be too.